Captain Mitchell, sir, we all think you did a hell of a job down in Mexico City. You followed everything on the Narcom. How you saved President Ballantyne and then General Martin. That battle at Chapultepec Castle, and how you led our guys into Socolo Plaza and took out the rebels. Well, I'm just honored to drive you, sir. And I'd be honored if you'd just keep your eyes on the road, soldier. Yes, sir. Of course, sir. We've got video incoming. Patching it through. And we now have confirmation that President Ballantyne has touched down in Washington. Both he and President Ruiz Peña insist the North American Joint Security Agreement will still be signed, despite yesterday's coup attempt in Mexico City that was finally put down with the help of U.S. forces. As for the recent outbreak of rebel activity in Honduras, Colombia, and Panama, unnamed U.S. sources now confirm their connection to yesterday's coup attempt in Mexico, raising concern that violence is spreading across the rest of Central America. Reporting live from Panama is Marco Zambrota. In the last 24 hours, the rebel forces here, led by Gabriel Alfaro, have essentially shut down the Panama Canal. U.S. forces have moved into the area amidst widespread reports that the rebels are looting ships and stealing their cargo. There are also rumors that sensitive military gear have been taken, though any connection between events here and in Mexico still remains unclear. Lieutenant Rosen is expecting you at Fort Bliss, Captain. I guess after what went down in Mexico City, it'll be time for a little R&R, &R, huh? Maybe for you, son. Something tells me I'm just getting started. Damn, Captain. How the hell did you make it out of Mexico City? I know you probably want to hit the hay, but General Keating's got another situation going, one that requires the ghosts. So they've asked me to prep you for your next assignment using this battle simulator. Your performance during the simulation will be evaluated with a score given at the end of each phase, so try to treat this as a real combat situation, okay? To start, follow the instructions on your HUD.
Well done. Scott, when you're on the battlefield, you must keep in mind that maintaining cover will often be the key to your survival. Therefore, you should always observe your surroundings and identify all cover positions available before advancing. Outstanding, Captain. Very good, Captain, but you're not through yet. Careful, Scott. An enemy patrol has been spotted down the street to your left. Your mission is to neutralize it. Use the various covers around you to avoid being hit. Hey, I have to escuchar algo. All these hits you're taking will lower your score, Captain. Don't forget to use the available cover. That's the end of this exercise. Now take a look at your performance for this section. Okay, Captain, now you'll learn how to identify threats and neutralize them from a distance. For that, you'll use a rifle equipped with a scope. Go to the position indicated on your HUD to get your rifle. In urban environments, threats can come from anywhere. They could be lurking around a corner or waiting to prey upon you from a rooftop. Your scope will help you identify these threats.
Good, Scott. Now take your time and stay focused. Okay, Scott. Hostiles have been spotted on the hillside due east of your 20. Reach their position and take them out. Stay frosty, Scott. Try not to be surprised by your enemies. Oh, last thing. You'll be scored on the headshots you make. Good luck. That's the end of this exercise. Have a look at your performance for this section. Sometimes you'll be confronted by threats that you can't defeat directly. In this part of the simulation, we will look at stealth techniques for approaching a target without being shot. When there's no cover nearby, you can use smoke grenades to hide your progression. taking will lower your score, Captain. Don't forget to use the available cover. Outstanding, Captain. 
Captain, you will now have to approach and neutralize a hostile heavy armor piece. To do this, you'll have to move as close as you can and throw an explosive charge near the vehicle. Remember to use available cover and smoke grenades to avoid being hit. Okay, Scott, that's it for this exercise. Now check out your performance. Captain, I need you to join your team in the truck. Let's go, Scott. Regroup. Regrouping. Captain, this is your team. The screen on the left of your HUD is the new Crosscom command interface. It will allow you to give orders to your teammates and control such vehicles as drones, helicopters, and even heavy armored vehicles. Move. Moving, Captain. Move now. Move into position. Move. Moving to position. In position. Let's move. Moving now. Fall back on me. Regroup. Understood. No worries, Captain. We're right with you. Move now. Moving, Captain. Move. Moving to position. 
Well done, Captain. For the next part, we'll work on advanced battle tactics. Your teammates can use two rules of engagement, recon and assault. Let's try these modes in a battle situation. Attack! Roger that. Aggressive. Take a look ahead. Let's move. Sneak and peek. On it. Regroup. Regrouping. Regroup. Fall back on me. Regroup. Understood. Attack! Roger that. Aggressive. Check up ahead for hostiles. Go quiet. Roger that. Move now. Moving to position. In position. Your teammates have spotted hostiles, but note that they are in recon mode, so they do not engage the enemy. As you can see, a stealthy approach gives your men the opportunity to get in close and take the first shot, giving them a huge advantage over their enemies. Check fire! Hold fire, Roger! Yeah, none left, Captain! Move now. Moving to position. I think you're ready to use your team in a battle situation, so let's go. Okay, secure the area indicated on your tactical map. An area is considered secured only when no enemies remain in the zone. Last thing, since this exercise is for testing your command skills, do not use your own gun. Try letting your guys do the job. Contact. Two, two, west. We have contact! the van. Down the one. Brown, go in the cover. No shot, no shot. Need to move. Awaiting order. They're on the move. More of them. Let's move. Over by that container thing. No shot, no shot. Gotta move. Awaiting order. Shot, ghostly. No one in sight, Captain. Fall back on me. Regroup. Understood. We're with you, Captain. Move. Moving, Captain. Contact everybody. Contact in the zone. I see three, boss. West, west. Looking for cover! Shoot that bastard! Captain! Taking hostile fire! There! Damn, Two! Up. No! Make that one left! He's dead. That's the end of this exercise. Let's check out your performance. In this section, we'll focus on how you communicate and deliver orders to your teammates. Quick responsiveness and team cohesions are keys to success on the battleground, and your time spent here will pay big dividends once the shooting starts. We're with you, Captain. Take a look ahead. Sneak and peek. On it. Let's move. Moving now. In position. 
Contact everybody. Contact in the zone. Enemy vehicle. See it? Due northeast. Move. Move into position. Move now. Moving now. Affirmative. Mitchell, one of your teammates here. is down. He will soon die unless you or a teammate heal him. And a word of advice? Be sure all opposition in the zone are neutralized before healing one of your men. Otherwise, you may get shot as well. Let's move. Moving now. Fall back on me. Regroup. I needed that! Check up ahead for hostiles. Move! Go quiet. Roger that. Fall back on me. Regroup. No worries, Captain. We're right with you. Regroup. Regrouping. Lead the way, Captain. Fall back on me. Regroup. We're with you, Captain. Regroup. Regrouping. Move now. Regroup. Move into position. Regroup. Understood. Attack! We'll regroup, you, boss. You that. Aggressive. Fall back on me. Regroup. Fall back on me. Regroup. Fall back on me. Regroup. We're with you, Captain. Take a look ahead. Sneak and peek. On it. Regroup. Regrouping. Lead the way, Captain. Fall back on me. Regroup. Understood. No worries, Captain. We're right with you. Regroup. Medic! Little TLC over here! Hang in there, boss! You're gonna be okay! Captain, during your missions you'll have numerous vehicles under your command. A UAV drone will be waiting for you at your next position. Move out. You'll now see how your cross-com interface can control the new UAV recon drone. This drone will help you locate enemies before they spot you. Wide open, people.
Stay sharp, everybody. The drone has detected a rebel soldier, but beware, the drone is within enemy range and can be shot down, so you may want to keep it at a safe altitude. Scott, note that once the drone has marked a soldier, a red intel marker appears to indicate his position. These markers will remain on soldiers as long as the drone is in their vicinity, but be careful, if the drone leaves the area, the intel markers vanish. And remember, the more you use the drone to scan a threat, the more reliable data it will collect. Okay, Scott, you did great. I think that about wraps up the battle sim. I've got General Keating standing by with a mission plan he's developing. He'll fill you in once you're back in the Blackhawk. Mitchell, let me be the first to say you've already done enough for one man, so I don't like the idea of sending you back in. But the fight ain't over. We've still got Buku rebel activity in Chiapas, the Yucatan, Veracruz, and right here across the border in Juarez, which is where I really need your cojones, son. The rebels have kept the U.S., Mexico, and Canada from signing the North American Joint Security Agreement. And now Congress is getting cold feet about us putting down this insurgency. So I do not know where you're going or what you're doing. Understood? What do I know? Our intel says the rebels may already have their hands on some nasty technology. Could be a dirty bomb, maybe biologicals. The only hard intel we have is that they're waiting on additional hardware from Panama. That's why I need you on the ground. You must secure and neutralize that package. Juarez is right on the border with the U.S. They're just too damn close. I can't stress enough the importance of your mission. You'll have some Mexican Army friendlies offering support on this op, Mitchell. For the present, your main objective with these boys will be to punch a hole through the enemy lines. Get into Juarez, son, and get me that package from Panama. I'm not gonna blow sunshine up your ass, Mitchell. Expect heavy resistance. Local intel confirms multiple artillery pieces protecting a rebel position two ticks from your insertion point. I've got Lieutenant Barnes patching through video intel. Hey, Captain. I'll be feeding you intel as it becomes available. Okay, Captain. This video shows the enemy training camp. You can also see two areas where artillery pieces are hidden. Your mission is to locate those artillery pieces and destroy them so we can attack the enemy camp. Let's make it quick. In and out, son. Bienvenidos a Mexico, Scott. I'd ask you to send me a postcard, except... you're not officially here. Then I'll bring you back an unofficial bottle of mezcal. With the worm. Now got ghosts touching down. Choose your squad, Scott.
Scott, you're gonna get pounded unless you take out those artillery pieces protecting the camp. To do that, you'll first need to ID their locations. How you get into position is up to you. Fall back on me. Regroup. No worries, Captain. We're right with you. 